So why is that the right school for us? Well, my daughters go around saying they're not in the best school in Dubai, but in the best school in the world. So that sums it up. I personally love the sense of community we have in our school. I love how, you're, how it feels like a family away from family and away from home. I love how we're greeted with great smile every morning once the school gates are open. And I love how Mr. Clarkson knows every child's name from the first week of school. This is a non-profit school. It's a school that is a community and actually moreover a family with a remarkable ethos. I am very honoured and very proud to be a part of um, the Des family and I have been for the last five years. Um, the standard of the school is exceptional and the standard of education outstanding. Uh, the sporting facilities are extraordinary and um, at DES you can be assured that the teachers and all the staff have an invested interest in your children. I think DES is unique because it is a fully inclusive school. Every child has the opportunity for whatever they want, whether it be physical education, academic, or performing arts or all, whatever they wish they can have. The resource at the school is truly amazing and the support that is given by the teaching staff to the support staff and the parents. The third uh, unique quality of the school are the teachers themselves. I get the impression that the teachers are personally vested in the education and welfare of their students um, beyond it being just a mere job and for me that makes all the difference. Our children only joined DES in January 2020, my son being in year four and daughter in year five. We have been incredibly pleased with the changes that we have seen in our children, particularly the fact that most of their learning to date has been accessed remotely. I'd say that the changes that we've seen can be summarised as greater independence, resilience, and we've noticed a real passion for them for learning. And I think that these things can be attributed to the quality of the provision that DES provides for all their children. The feedback that our children have received has been warm, it's been welcoming, it's been fair, and it's been positive and certainly very individual for each of our children. The teachers are a credit to the school and their passion and enthusiasm for the education of our children has been more than we could have ever wished for. We are extremely grateful for the changes that we have seen in our children and look forward to them continuing their journey at DES. I mean, to be honest, we've been pretty blown away by the, um, the quality and the standards and how the teachers have just kept on doing that after all this time is, is really amazing. Um, obviously, it's not the same as being in school, but um, as a second best, it's been really absolutely amazing and has continued even after all this time. It's not sort of waned off at all. One of the primary reasons we chose DES for our children, amongst many, was because we had heard that the transition from the primary to the secondary was a really seamless and easy process, and we haven't been disappointed. From as year, early as year four, um, our daughter was introduced to DES, from regular school trips to the campus, to meeting all the students who have shared their personal experiences with her. In year six, this was escalated even more, where she had the opportunity to have an even more hands-on approach. She mentioned um, seeing the ICT suite, which was one of her memories. She uh, mentioned how amazing the library was, and she also spoke about even playing a game of water polo. So as a result of this continuous backward and forwarding from both campuses, um, the transition to desk for her feels like a very comfortable and natural move. It's hard to believe how fast time flies. Next year, Jake will be going into year nine and Emily will be going to the college for year seven. But this transition between desk and desk is fairly seamless because of the transition days that they do starting in year four. All three of our children have already had the opportunity to use the design and technology facilities. They've also participated in a few sports days put on by the BTEC students. So by the time they've 
they reach year six, they've already become quite comfortable with the Dust Campus and feel quite at ease there. You know, I can remember me going from my grade school to my high school, and it was actually quite a, a scary experience. But for our kids, they're not going from one place to another. They're just going from one building to another building, but still in the Dust family. So they're actually quite excited about it. There were many reasons why we chose DES for our three children and it wasn't just the outstanding facilities and teachers that they have, it was a feeling we got when we walked through the gates, a feeling that our children were going to be really happy here, that they were going to succeed and enjoy school and that we would be able to be part of their learning journey, that once they became a DES pupil we would become part of the DES family. There's a real sense of community here where parents are actively encouraged to be part of the children's learning journey, whether it's taking part in International Day or coming along to a coffee morning to find out about how your child's learning to read so that you can work together in partnership. And that was really important to us, a lovely sense of community. We are so proud to be part of the DESC community. Since joining the school, we have been made to feel very welcome by everybody. Everyone is so friendly and so proud to be part of DES and uh, what it stands for, the history um, and everything that it's involved in, uh, inside of school and outside of school. They truly, they truly are part of everything uh, that goes on in the world globally and also locally. We are looking forward to getting back to school. The kids really want to see their friends. We want to catch up with the other parents, chat outside school. Just the normal things we miss and the reason why you send your kids to school. And I think uh, our kids have done really well and survived it, but I don't think they could really, I think the thought of them not seeing their friends again in that social part of school was going to be, would be very tough. Yeah, absolutely. The social side has been um, very much missed, but with the WebEx meetings that the teachers have done, um, that's been a really good way for them to touch base with their friends and with their teachers a little bit. Um, and then the hope is obviously they get to see them in real life before too long.